FSN medical technology displays. How to control them. First tip, poke them once to wake them up. Next, you have minus, plus, down, and up. When you press menu, you now can go down, you can go up, you can go plus or right, or you can change or select that option to change it to what you want it to be. Straightforward. To back out, press the menu button and menu again to remove the on screen display. Pretty simple, right? Input. Tap it once. Choose the input that you want, HDMI, select or plus. Picture in picture. Now we have two different video sources going into the display. We want, to see them, we want to see them at the same time. Let's go ahead to picture in picture, which is one big picture and a small picture in the top right. Picture in a picture. Select it. And in this case, we have our DVI up here and an HDMI here. Next, we'll go into input. We selected this one, and now we can change that to display port 2 or DVI, etc. We don't want to do that. We want to change the picture in picture. Input once, twice the big one, like a small one. Now we can change it to another input here, too. It's very useful. Menu to exit out of that. To remove it, go to picture in picture. And go up to single and select it. We have this just the way we want it. So to keep it that way, we're going to use the lock function. Take two fingers and press plus and up at the exact same time. It's now locked. There is no chance for inadvertent button pushing to change it or power it down. Keeping your monitor perfectly safe, just the way you want it. All right, to unlock it, two fingers again. It's now unlocked. they are free to power off, press menu, change inputs, etc. at our will. And last and finally, we have the power button. Just hold it, and it goes out. Powering it back up, same thing. Hold it, and it powers up. Thanks for watching and contact us today at fsnmed.com.